The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring. From Tampa, Florida, weighing in 425 pounds, one half of the WCW World Tag Team Champions, Paul White. You can feel the intensity level inside the arena rising. Man, I can't wait to see these two square off in one-on-one -on -one action. And approaching the ring from the Jersey Shore, weighing in at 248 pounds, the WCW United States Champion, Diamond Dallas Page. Diamond Dallas Page looks to be in tremendous shape heading into this one, King. Well, you know, Michael, it must be all the yoga that DDP does. The fans have been demanding this one-on-one -on -one contest, and here it is. King, as we get started here, I've got to ask you, have you ever come across anybody with more positive attitude than Diamond Dallas Page? You know, let me think. I don't, I don't believe I have, Cole. This guy makes Bo Dallas look like a Debbie Downer. There's the camel clutch, and somehow he's got to take the pressure off his neck. And he lets him out. Well, he might have been losing some of his grip there anyway. He probably figured it would be better to release the hole now before his opponent could counter it. Tell us your thoughts on Paul White. King, I just cannot get over the size of this latest WCW defector, Paul White. He's enormous. Oh, my gosh. I bet he eats off a satellite dish. Big show. Big nasty. I don't care what they call Paul White. Just as long as the word big is in there. Because he's every bit of it. Definitely looking good so far. Hasn't taken too much punishment up to this point. Great one-on-one -on -one action here tonight. It doesn't get much better than this. Nice move! And not only is Paul White big, but he's also incredibly strong, as he demonstrated shortly after he debuted when he literally lifted the ring off the ground. Competing at full health here, definitely in a good position. Paul White is not someone to take lightly. Why well, is the guy his opponent, and what's he going for here? He's doing everything he can to get his bearings back here. Otherwise, this match could be over sooner than anyone could have anticipated. Yeah, Cole, this is when you have to settle things down. Get the blood flowing back in your body and strategize what your next move or your next form of attack will be. <laughs> Lifting the ring off the ground was impressive, Cole. But how about when he tore the Titantron from the arena ceiling? I'm telling you, this Paul White is a freak of nature. This will be a physical battle. You're right about that, Cole. This is going to be a war. This could be... So I guess he's done with that move. Yeah, but what's he going to do next? Just toying with the competition a little. Yep, there's the reversal by Paul White. Oh! We're 
We're seeing two outstanding athletes looking to prove their dominance in there. But only one can walk out victorious. Who will it be? Diamond Dallas Page takes the upper hand here. When looking back at the entirety of Diamond Dallas Page's career, here's a man who refused to be denied his spot in sports entertainment history. It's well documented now, but DDP was the man who drove rhythm and blues to the ring in his pink Cadillac at WrestleMania 6. For many, chauffeuring Honky Talk Man and Greg Valentine to the ring would have been a career highlight, but not DDP. He was motivated to become a star. You're right, Cole. Diamond Dallas Page is probably the most motivated superstar I've ever come across. And positive. Well, wow, that positively Page thing is no gimmick. DDP is definitely a glass half full kind of guy. Great one-on-one -on -one action here tonight. It doesn't get much better than this. King, you mentioned Paige's motivation and positivity. I think it's worth mentioning that many credit DDP's infectious character for helping both Scott Hall and Jake Roberts achieve great success in recent years. Oh, no! Diamond Dallas Page with the opportunity! This kind of offense he's known for. Yeah, you're right about that. He's made a name for himself with this. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. That wild strike found nothing but empty air that time. <laughs> Man, that's what you call swinging for the fences and missing. What a brutal drop. Situations like this push competitors to the limit. Yeah, and I think he's almost to the limit. Oh, man, he's going off here. I don't know if this is by design or if he just lost his mind. Yeah, I think he's stuck on the repeat button. Going for the cover. These superstars looking for a victory, looking to build momentum. You're right about that. Momentum is so much. Hamill clutch locked in. Wrenching on the neck and lower back. And there's the release. What's going to happen now? I'm scared to ask. Now, who does a methodical pace benefit, King? Well, I'll tell you, whenever the dominating competitor takes his time, it gives everybody a chance to catch their breath. Oh, man. Just look at the gargantuan size of this man. Paul White's size 22 boot is longer than most people's jacket sleeves. I mean, he is truly a giant, and he can crush his opponent anytime he so chooses. Can he do it? Can he dig down deep and fight out of this hold? And he lets him out. Well, he might have been losing some of his grip there anyway. He probably figured it would be better to release the hold now before his opponent could counter it. He's in full-on attack mode now. Setting it up. End of story. This one's over. Covers. One, two. King, you want to talk about hitting the nail on the head? Paul White's massive seven foot two frame makes almost everyone else feel like they're vertically challenged. Trust me, there's no there it is, the discus clothesline. Oh man, your head winds up flying off like a discus. How much damage did that do? A lot from the looks of the shoulders are down. Look at these two giving it their all. There's absolutely no quit in them tonight. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, and he missed that one. God, that's gotta hurt. Yeah. You're not doing any damage with swings like that, but keep doing it. The freeze may give him a cold. Here comes Paul White. Oh, choke slam. Paul White just broke him in half. With Paul White. He made it. He made it to the ropes. A knockdown drag out brawl, complete with a big stomp. Man, these guys are throwing bombs. They're pulling out all the stops. Opportunity here for DDP, right where he wants him. 
Well, now that's it. What a finishing move. This could be it right here. Oh, God. Looking for the quick pin. I don't think even the referee was ready for that. Let's go to the highlights here. Let's take a look at some of the big highlights. I can't believe what we saw in that match. Here's your winner, Paul White. Impressive showing there and route to the win. This win is exactly why so many superstars hope their number never gets called to face this guy. Matches like that are the reason why I love this job so much.